Nigerian actors and actresses made the country proud at the 2015 Africa Magic Viewers' Choice Awards. The popular comedian and filmmaker Ayo Makun's 30 Days in Atlanta picked up the first award of the event. 30 Days in Atlanta was named the best film in a comedy category. I'm a standard comedian for, for the Metro Vision. I work, I work for my money. So you worked? Yes, I work. You violated your visa. He broke the law. I don't break the law. I want to break. Kunle Afolayon was crowned the best director for his movie October 1st. Kunle also picked up the overall best movie prize for the year 2014. <laughs> the multi talented actor went home with nine awards in different categories. Rita Dominic was named the best actress in the comedy category for her role in the movie The Meeting, while Osi Ukeji clinched the best actor prize for his performance in the movie Secret Room. Meanwhile, Nigerian reggae and dance hall act Pato Rankin has been named the MTV based artist of the month of March 2015. <laughs> The video of Kiss Daniel's hit track, Woju, has taken over the number one spot of MTV Bay's official top 10 Ninja countdown from Whiskey's Ujue Legba. <laughs> now to the foreign scene. Hollywood star Harrison Ford escaped death when the Star Wars actor crashed his vintage plane on a Los Angeles golf course shortly after taking off from a nearby airport. According to Mr. Ford's publicist, the engine of the actor's plane suddenly developed a fault, so he had to make an emergency landing on the golf course. The actor is said to be receiving treatment in the hospital. An investigation team has been set up by the U.S. National Transportation Safety Board to determine the cause of the crash. The co-creator and producer of the cartoon The Simpsons, Sam Simon, has passed on. He was aged 59. Late Simon was diagnosed with colon cancer in February 2013. The influential Simon also served as the showrunner on the popular sitcom Taxi, at the age of 23, he wrote and produced several comedies. Late Simon, until his death, was a nine-time Emmy Award-winning comedy writer. While alive, he worked on several episodes of the cartoon The Simpsons.